right, so we just finished our little basic demo of creating this little square part with a circle, bolt circle, and a frame. I want to take that same geometry that we programmed in the program and now do something a little more advanced with it or something more that you can do to show that you can reuse geometry. You don't have to reprogram it every time. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a chamfer tool. I've got tool number 10 and 11 that we did. I'm going to do tool number 12. I'm going to make that a chamfer mill. I'm going to go to our advanced tool settings here. And on the advanced tool settings, as I highlight a field, it tells me on this little image what it's looking for. It wants to know the diameter. Let's do a half inch, uh, 20 thou tip radius. Let's go down to our side angle of 45. It's going to be a 90 degree included. So now I have tool number 13 created, or tool number 12 created. Let's go back to our program. I'm going to hit the review screen here. And we have three um, blocks that I'm going to copy and reuse. So I'm going to open the keyboard here. I'm going to click on block one. I'm going to hit the shift key. And then I'm going to highlight all three of those blocks. Multiple block functions and copy. I'm now going to paste those at the end of the program. And I'm going to go in and change the tool number, the depth, and in some cases the strategy. So we're going to go to the mill circle. This time I'm going to go 0 0.030, just 30 thousandths deep. I'm going to use tool 12. And I don't need to do a pocket, I'm just going to do an inside. Let's go to the next block. This is our mill frame. We're going to go down 30 thou minus 0 0.03 using tool 12. Still going to go outside, that's fine. And then our last one is going to be our holes block. I'm just going to go in and chamfer those holes and give it a 3 8 diameter chamfer. So we're going to go down minus 0.5 times 0.375 to give us that depth we need to go down for a 90 degree. Tool 12. And now if I go draw, so you can see we're going to go ahead and run through the part as we did before. Then it's going to come back in, chamfer everything, putting the chamfers on the holes, chamfer around the outside of this frame, and a chamfer on the inside of this circle. All right, so that shows how easy it is to just reuse geometry you've already programmed, especially if all you want to do is chamfer that geometry. You don't have to reprogram it. You can just copy and paste those blocks, change the strategy, the tool, the depth, and you're good to go.